So I just use my ah. uh, I guess it's off. Let me put my spectacles on. My handy dandy, trusty, musty, dusty, super duper socket wrench. That's <laughs> it, huh? Hey everybody, Ricky here with Apple Valley Farm. Wanted to share something real quick with you. A, a little tip, I guess you'd call it a, a shop tip, a uh, shop hack, something like that. So anyway, regardless of what it is, it's a tip to help save you some time and to help save you fingers. So I'm doing this sign right here, and you've probably seen these signs online. You know, it's kind of like a, an alternative to a calendar, really, for family birthdays. And you put these hooks on here, I'm sorry, you put these hooks on here, and then family members whose birthdays are in this month hang below this and so on and so on. And uh, anyway, and it's, it's, a, it's really cool, but you know, we've got 12 hooks to put in here and, and it, it starts wearing on your fingers. So this is just something that I've learned over the years when you have to do a lot of stuff like this. You take a lazy man and uh, give him a job to do, then he's gonna find something innovative. He's gonna find a, an innovative, ingenious way to do it easier. So that's how, that's how lazy people work. Anyway, what I'm going to do, I'm going to take this hook, and I'm using, for this project, I'm using three-quarter inch cup hooks. And that's, they're just called cup hooks because they would screw up into the bottom of something and you'd hang your cup right there. I guess I could move my hand over there, couldn't I? Anyway, three-quarter inch cup hooks, taking my socket wrench and a half-inch socket. And this fits right in there. Look at that. So we'll just take that and I'll wrench that thing down and that way it saves my fingers. And then when it gets down to the end of it, then I'll, I'll adjust it and finish it right off. Here, let me show you real quick and then you'll see what I'm talking about. I'll just take a hook. I've pre-drilled some pilot holes in here because I don't want to split my board. And I'm just gonna get this thing started just takes a few rounds to get it started. Want it to be good and straight in there. Take my socket wrench, fit it down over it, turn it a few times until I see the shoulder of that hook come down close to the wood. Then I stop. Then I can uh, finish it off by hand. And then move on to the next one. Easy, easy, easy. All right, guys, so that's it. So that's, I don't know, we could come up with an official term for this, the socket cup hook method. There we go. The socket cup hook method, courtesy of me. So there you go. I hope that helps. Uh, just a simple little hack to, to help you save your fingers. I know it saves mine. So hope that helps you. Hope you guys have a good day. Hey, if you need anything, have any questions, Give me a shout, ricky at applevalleyfarmga.com. Visit us at applevalleyfarmga.com or uh, like, comment, and subscribe to us on our YouTube channel. We would love to have you. Thanks a lot. Have a great day. Go make something. See ya.